All right, so you've been through a couple of weeks of uh, preseason camp. Uh, how's it been going? I think it's been going really well. I think uh, both the offense and defense have, you know, really hitting their strides now. Uh, everything's clicking. Our offense is going, it's going where it needs to be, and our defense is looking very good. What would you say have been the biggest improvements on the Stetson University football team since the time you've arrived uh, to where it is now? Uh, probably the camaraderie that the team has. Uh, I think everybody gels together really nice. We have a mentee mentor program, and I think that that makes uh, a big difference on the team. Everybody's closer now. Uh, it's really like a family now. Do you have any uh, particular goals that you want to accomplish this season on be behalf of the team? And if you do, uh, what would the goals be? Uh, the goals probably would be as a whole as the offensive line uh, because without the guy next to me, uh, I don't think I'd be able to, to do my job properly. It, it's all about trust, and it takes all five of us, especially on the offensive line, to, to get something going. So I think a goal for me would be a, have a good offensive line. All right, Dre, so how has the uh, preseason uh, been treating you? Um, it's been good. Um, we've been attacking it. Um, had some tough practices, and we're fighting through, um, getting better as a team. What would you say has been the best thing about being a member of the uh, Stetson University football team? The best thing about it, uh, we form bonds. It's like a brotherhood out here. Uh, we get better um, playing for the guy beside you, and these guys over the course of the, my time here become like brothers to me. And what would you say has been the uh, biggest improvement from the time you arrived here in DeLand to uh, where this uh, program is now? Uh, biggest improvement, I would say the culture. I got here a while ago, and you know I've seen, I've been here for every season that we play games, and the culture is really nowhere close. It's, you can't even compare it. We're, we're a lot further than we were when we started, and I think that's going to help us win a lot of games this year. When you look at the schedule they're playing this season, obviously we have a tough slate of games against the Pioneer Football League, also a couple of tough games against um, some non-conference teams. Uh, are there any particular teams that you're looking at on the schedule that you really want to, you're really gung-ho to play against? And if so, uh, which teams are those? Um, I think I'm excited to play Sacred Heart because we, we, I, I know everyone on this team feels like we had that game and that we, uh, we let them off the hook, so I'm ready for that one. Uh, Campbell and Jacksonville are a couple rivals of ours. Um, Campbell games are always fun, and Jacksonville's uh, you know, probably the closest team we play, and I'm looking forward to playing them one last time. All right, Johnny, so how has the uh, preseason uh, been for you so far this season? It's been pretty well. Uh, we, we're out here a lot, put a lot of hours in, so obviously we get tired, but we got to make sure we're uh, hydrated and eat well and stay healthy. So, I mean, we've, we've definitely come together as a team, and I'm really loving it here. What has been the, the biggest uh, improvement the program has made from the time that you started kicking for the Hatters uh, to where the Hatters are now? I'd say definitely uh, our closeness as a team. We're de we definitely seem to be more of a family this year. I'd say it helps uh, with the trust factor between players and coaches. And you looking ahead at the schedule, uh, are there any particular teams that you um, – are really looking forward to, to playing when I mean, you look through, through the schedule of the, the Pioneer Football League teams as well as the non-conference teams? Are there any particular teams that you want to play maybe more than others? Uh, I'd say Sacred Heart because I felt like we definitely could have won last year, so definitely going to go with the chip on our shoulders. But every conference game I'm looking forward to because I really want to win the PFL title. And from a, a personal uh, standpoint, uh, on behalf of the team, are there any particular goals that you want to achieve that – uh, would help make the uh, the team as successful as it can be? My goal is to make every single kick and give the kickoff team good coverage, give uh, the good ball placement so they can cover it inside the 20. 